Afternoon, ladies and gents. And you are looking at the iconic Cutty Sark. Ooh, wasp. And the Gypsy Moth pub. But a nice day in Greenwich today. Uh, the Queen's House, up on the hill to the Greenwich, Greenwich Observatory. See the Greenwich Meridian line and all that. There it is. God, this heat. It's viciously warm. I'm not complaining though, because I do prefer the summer. The summer. Well, I am complaining, but I do prefer the summer. You can um, climb up the rigging and that and abseil down it. It's, uh, I think it's about 40 odd pound, but if that's your thing, it's always an experience worth having. I'm not too keen on heights. Oh look, climb on board and touch history. And you literally can climb up to the rig in there. Last time I came, when I, when I did the uh, Cutty Sark, I covered it in the video, people were climbing up and up so were going back down again on them rope things. So they seem to be enjoying themselves. I bet you get some lovely views from up there, I'll say that. Right across the Thames and such like. Just pointing you down a minute, guys and girls, because there's a lot of kids around at the moment and it's busy here. But you aren't just going to be getting a view of a a floor. Cutty Sark. Figurehead up there. This won't be a long one anyway, it's mainly just um, <clears throat> catch up and some views. I am literally baked because it's bloody hot. I climbed all the way to the top of the uh, the hill. The Greenwich Mirror, uh, the uh, Greenwich thing. In there, you can't really see it through the tinted glass, but it's all um, ship's figureheads. Well worth seeing. I think it's about £16 to get on now. That's gone up, because when I came, I believe it was 10 but Inflation. I'm never going to get away from that, and everything has gone up. Cost of living crisis and such like. On there, this bit, there's a plaque about, I think it was a, yeah, it was a young boy. He was doing the rigging on this thing and a young boy and a man and a wave came over and washed them off. And they was lost at sea. <coughs> oh, it's nice and cool here. I should stand at this bit and have my lunch. Well, do you know whatever you want to call it? I've had a nice ice cream today, slush puppy. Just one sausage roll because I can't eat much in this heat. And I've took some uh, Jammy Joe cakes out with me, which I'm going to eat in a minute. And that's me done. I'll have something to eat when I get back in. It's too warm to eat. Big meals for me. I can't in this heat. Anyway, and we've seen this view from today, which was very, very nice. This is a bit wobbly, this fence, this uh, row. I wouldn't want to fall against that if I was drunk. Yeah. Oh. And let's see, Katty Sark there, guys and girls. As I said, this wasn't going to be a long one, so I uh, hope you've all enjoyed today's viewings. There'll be some views and stuff on the way home anyway, so possibly, depending if I ain't too trashed. But there's always another day for that, if not take care all thank you all for watching hope you all enjoyed if you did please give it a like and a share and thanks for all the support on that everyone thank you <laughs> that's what you call a booze cruise isn't it i don't know if you could hear that they've got a pirate flag up on the front and it's juggling garage all the way the viscount the little boat the ship's called on little boat yeah that's good for my eyesight these new glasses must be all right I've finished everything, well, done over, not everything, fin done over there for today. Done the Queen's House, which was impromptu, which I didn't intend on doing. I was just going to have a look at the outside of that. Saw that it was open, went inside, and well, 
I was just like a kid in a candy store to be honest with you. So yeah, it's been a really nice day today. Um, I'm going to jump on the bus in a minute, I'm just having a smoke before I jump on the bus. I may stop off somewhere on the way between here, which is at Island Gardens near Canary Wharf and Poplar for some views, but I'm not sure yet. I'm, a pre I'm pretty knackered, so I'll see how I feel. Well, I mean, if not, it's not going to run away. So I've got the observatory to do yet. Uh, the Queen's House was just not enough to not enough time to cover it in one day. Um, I had to start rushing in the end because of time, so I'll definitely be doing a revisit in there. I mean, they've got Van Gogh's, Monet, um, my favourite of all the art there, and it's all spectacular pretty much, but my favourite is the Armada portrait of Queen Elizabeth I. She's my favourite Tudor, and I've always wanted to see that picture, that portrait rather. I thought it was in the National Gallery, because I didn't really research properly where it was. To be honest with you, when I first started doing the page, I didn't much think I'd be going to art galleries and whatnot that, but I'm branching out as I'm going along and starting to try new things and enjoy new things as well. When I was younger, art would have bored the shit out of me, but now I've had a, I must have had a really nice day. Because it isn't just portraits in there, I mean, for me, you had watches and clocks, which I absolutely love, apart from all the architecture, the history of the place. Yeah, that's me happy. That's the booze because oh, they're turning around. <laughs> there is an absolutely gorgeous breeze here. <clears throat> if I was homeless, this wouldn't be where I would be sleeping by the river at night time because it's nice and cool. I should imagine it's pretty cold in the early hours though. Anyway guys and girls, this was just a little miniature catch up, um, just to let you know what's going on, what may be going on, what we've done today and that. Um, hope everyone's okay and uh, coping in this heat. I heard from my nephew who does not like the heat. My mum's the same, she doesn't like the heat, but she's getting an air conditioner, so 20 fans Mal, as she's known, may not have 20 fans anymore once she gets her air conditioner. Anyway guys and girls, thank you all for watching and whatnot today and the likes and comments and support and interaction. It does mean